I don't believe corn-based ethanol is that renewable fuel that we need to, we need to follow. Um, when Kansas City, is, Kansas City is petitioning to be exempt from the mandate because the corn-based ethanol is adding to smog and air pollution, uh, I don't think any fuel that we they can, anything that can reduce our dependency on gas but remove our ability to breathe is, is a good solution. Um, I, think that, uh, I think that there's other options. I think switchgrass, I think algae, I think other types of biomass have potential. I don't think we should give up on the idea of ethanol. I think we should take what we've learned that we can, you know, use, we can do something here domestically. We've got infrastructure we've built, but we need to find a way to improve. We need to find a way to make sure that we're not burning our food in the gas tanks. We're not driving up prices. We're not causing inflation. Um, and I think it, it's we could now is we've come to the point where it's not really an environmental issue. It's just become another agricultural subsidy. And I think we need to end it. And I think we especially need to end the fact that a lot of members and state legislators in Jeff City are making uh, hands of profit off it. I think that needs to end as well. Thank you, Mr. Weber. Ms. Iverson, your view on ethanol mandate? I, we should have gotten, that's one of the things that we should have gotten rid of during the session. I mean, that mandate should have been gone by now. Um, it, it, is, it is another example of our attempt to find an easy answer or a magic bullet. Say, this is it. This will fix everything if we just do ethanol. There is some room for ethanol and the other renewable fuels. But I think mandating ethanol, it doesn't have the, the same energy capacity as gas, so you end up having to buy more of it even though it's cheaper. Um, I think it wasn't, the lure of that easy answer was so seductive that everybody kind of jumped on that bandwagon. And I think we know, know enough now that we shouldn't put all our eggs in that particular basket.